Welcome back, Regan. Thank you, Gareth. How's the first uh, three weeks of uh, pre-season been? Yeah, it's been tough. Uh, I was kind of expecting it, my age. But uh, hanging on the boys' coattails at the moment. It's nice to be back, though. Bit of sunshine to start with, but uh, it's looking to change at the moment. So. Yeah, I think we've had our first uh, hint of uh, rain. Um, probably something he wasn't used to in France. Uh, how's the family settled in? Uh, slowly settling in. It's been quite a difficult transition, to be honest. Uh, we had a bit of trouble with the movers, but that's finally sorted. Wife's head's back on now, and uh, we're just looking to get the kids into school. Then we're out until September, so I'm going to drive my wife a bit mad at home for the next couple of months, but have to put up with it, isn't it? Well, obviously you've uh, picked up a lot of experience. Obviously you had a lot going, but um, how did you, you know, how did you, how was it out in uh, Claremont? Oh, it was good. Obviously a lot of international quality players there. Uh, fighting for your spot every week. <laughs> Nothing's assured there. Um, you you got to train hard, train well and perform on Saturday. And uh, it's just the nature of the beast playing there. If you don't perform, you don't play, basically. So, you know, there's a lot of different cultures and different nationalities that are there. And you learn a lot of uh, a lot of different people how they do things, how the French do things, how the Fijians do things, Australians, whatnot. But um, overall, it's a really good experience. I, I think my family enjoyed it as well. Kids are fluent in French now. Little translators for me because I'm not. But uh, no, overall, it's a really uh, really good experience. Obviously, for us guys to have you back, especially some of the the younger guys in the squad, obviously it's, it's great to see them picking your brains about certain things already and. Is that something you're looking forward to, you know, bringing some of those experience back and, well, the guys of all ages in our squad, obviously they're looking to, to you know, to take, retain as much as they can from you. Is that something you're looking forward to doing? Yeah, well, it's not just them learning off me or me teaching them, it's me learning off them as well. Everyone's got something to offer and I just, I really like interacting with the players and showing what I've learned and trying to pick up anything that the younger guys or, or the guys my age, what, what they can show me as well. Obviously everyone plays rugby differently. We've all got our strengths and weaknesses and it's, uh, it's just really exciting actually coming back uh, coming back to Scarlet. There's a lot of young, new keynotes here. It keeps, uh, keeps the old boys on our toes and you know, familiar faces as well. But I'm, I'm really looking forward to the season. Um, hopefully we'll do well. So possibly by the next six weeks I should be able to have a left-handed <laughs> no-look pass in my <laughs> artillery. Gareth, I've seen glimpses of it already. Let's see, don't worry about that.